Coming up on a look around Lakota, the new culinary center at Union Elementary is more than meets the eye. Plus, we take job exploration seriously through a partnership with Junior Achievement. But first, we were proud to showcase our students and staff at Lakota's first ever State of the Schools event. Hello, and thank you for watching. I'm Matt Miller, Superintendent of Lakota Local Schools. The inaugural State of the Schools program put our students and staff front and center. Sixth graders at Freedom Elementary, also known as the Freedom Four, surprised the crowd with an original song they wrote called, Oh Lakota. Students and staff from schools throughout the district shared stories about their own Lakota experiences. Together, we celebrated the innovation happening all around our schools while providing a glimpse into future plans to continue moving Lakota forward. We were also excited to debut a short video called Why We Are Lakota. This video and the entire State of the Schools presentation can be found on the Lakota website. Union's new culinary center does more than teach students how to cook. Students are getting a taste of kitchen and food safety, nutrition education, and meal preparation, not to mention some tasty recipes. They are learning and practicing healthy eating habits. Like you don't have to have like tasty junk food that can like destroy your body, but healthy food can like help your body and it tastes good. Being at the culinary center changed my view of some vegetables. <laughs> Again, like kale, it was um, really good in a salad, and they helped me really experience like. I don't have to be all simple-minded. You can kind of create things that are above your comfort level and it might still be good. A big thank you to Junior Achievement and our local business community for rallying behind our students as they explore jobs that interest them. More than 500 eighth graders from Plains and Ridge Junior Schools chose from a list of 20 local businesses to visit for our annual Job Exploration Day. From law enforcement and technology to manufacturing and small business operation, our students experienced a wide range of career possibilities right here in our own community. Students at Hopewell and Liberty Junior Schools will have the same opportunity this May. They showed me a lot about the different types of engineers and how they all like contribute to um, like the coming together of what they make, like the buildings that they make. And I feel like I'm more driven towards being an engineer now. It gives you opportunities to like see what they do and how the, how all the machines work and what it basically what the whole job is about. Our students at Lakota East and West answered the national call to pay tribute to the 17 lives lost so tragically at Stoneman Douglas High School. I'm proud of our students for working alongside our principals to express their voices in a safe and respectful way. Safety continues to be a focal point of our daily work. Our district safety team's collaboration with local law enforcement is ongoing and we are always reviewing new ideas for giving our students a safe space to learn. Last month's social media challenge had our followers sharing all the reasons they love Lakota. To share the love, we delivered surprise valentines to the special people called out in the most popular posts. Congratulations to all of our winners. Lakota's sixth annual Summer Fun Fair was an all-around success for our business community and families. Hundreds filled Main Street at both high schools to see just how much our community has to offer in the form of summer youth activities. I'm excited to invite you to Lakota's first ever military commitment ceremony on April 5th at 7 p.m. at Lakota East Freshman Building. With our community's help, we're celebrating our graduates who have made the honorable decision to serve their country after graduation. This wraps up another edition of A Look Around Lakota. Enjoy your spring break and we'll see you back here soon. As always, thank you for your continued support of our students, staff, and schools.